In this video, we'll share the top 25 things to do in Texas. At number one, we have the San Antonio River Walk. This scenic area in downtown San Antonio offers a tranquil escape from the city's hustle and bustle. Visitors can enjoy a leisurely stroll along the river, dine at riverside restaurants, or simply soak in the vibrant atmosphere. At number two, we have the Alamo. This historic site in San Antonio is a symbol of Texas's struggle for independence from Mexico. Visitors can explore the mission buildings and learn about the pivotal Battle of the Alamo through various exhibits. At number three, we have the Sixth Floor Museum at Dealey Plaza. Located in downtown Dallas, this museum is dedicated to the life, death, and legacy of President John F. Kennedy. It offers a comprehensive look at the events surrounding his assassination. At number four, we have the Houston Museum of Natural Science. This museum in the Museum District of Houston offers a wide range of exhibits, from dinosaur displays to a butterfly exhibit and a planetarium. At number five, we have the Texas State Capitol. Located in downtown Austin, this historic site is home to the offices and chambers of the Texas Legislature and the Governor of Texas. Visitors can admire the architecture and learn about Texas's political history. At number six, we have the Dallas Arboretum and Botanical Gardens. This 66-acre garden offers a stunning display of plants and flowers, as well as great views of White Rock Lake. At number seven, we have the Natural Bridge Caverns. Located near San Antonio, these caverns are the largest known commercial caverns in the U.S. state of Texas. Visitors can explore the caverns through various tours. At number eight, we have the Fort Worth Stockyards National Historic District. This area in Fort Worth is known for its cowboy culture. Visitors can watch a cattle drive, shop for Western gear, and dine at local steakhouses. At number nine, we have the LBJ Presidential Library. Located in Austin, this library and museum is dedicated to President Lyndon B. Johnson. It houses documents and artifacts related to his presidency. At number 10, we have the National Museum of the Pacific War. Located in Fredericksburg, this museum is dedicated to the history of World War II in the Pacific. At number 11, we have the USS Lexington Museum. This museum is located on the aircraft carrier USS Lexington, which served in World War II and now is docked in Corpus Christi. At number 12, we have Mission San Jose. This historic mission in San Antonio is known for its beautiful architecture and the famous Rose Window. At number 13, we have Cowgirls and Cowboys in the West. This ranch offers horseback riding experiences in the Palo Duro Canyon, giving visitors a taste of the cowboy lifestyle. At number 14, we have the Museum of Fine Arts Houston. This museum in the Museum District of Houston houses a vast collection of art from around the world. At number 15, we have Sea Turtle Inc. This nature and wildlife area is dedicated to the conservation of sea turtles. Visitors can learn about these creatures and the organization's conservation efforts. At number 16, we have Grape Creek Vineyards Fredericksburg. This winery offers wine tastings and tours, allowing visitors to learn about the winemaking process and sample various wines. At number 17, we have the Lady Bird Lake Hike and Bike Trail. This trail in South Austin offers a scenic route for hiking and biking along the shores of Lady Bird Lake. At number 18, we have Palo Duro Canyon State Park. This state park is home to the second largest canyon in the United States. Visitors can hike, camp, and explore the ancient ruins in the park. At number 19, we have the Japanese Tea Gardens. These beautiful gardens in Uptown Broadway offer a tranquil setting with colorful koi fish swimming in the lagoon. At number 20, we have Barton Springs Pool. This natural spring-fed pool in South Austin is a popular spot for swimming and sunbathing. At number 21, we have the AT&T Stadium. This stadium in Arlington is home to the Dallas Cowboys. Visitors can take a tour of the stadium and learn about its architecture and history. At number 22, we have the George W. Bush Presidential Library and Museum. This library and museum in Dallas is dedicated to the life and presidency of George W. Bush. At number 23, we have the San Antonio Missions National Historical Park. This park preserves four of the five Spanish frontier missions in San Antonio. At number 24, we have the San Antonio River. This river runs through the heart of San Antonio and is a popular spot for boat rides, shopping, and dining. At number 25, we have the Bullock, Texas State History Museum. This museum in downtown Austin is dedicated to telling the story of Texas, with exhibits covering the state's history from prehistoric times to the present. So that sums up my top 25 things to do in Texas. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like on the video. 
And if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Until next time, have a great day.